Hey guys, I just had my six week follow up from my second reconstruction surgery. So it was the surgery where they took the tissue expanders out and they put implants in. So it's been actually six weeks today. Um, I just saw my plastic surgeon and everything's looking good. Um, she did mention uh, she kind of wanted to do a little bit more fat grafting right here, um, just because I have what's called shelving. So it kind of just, as you can kind of see, it just is very prominent where the chest wall kind of meets the implant. Um, so she wanted to do a little bit more fat grafting in that area. Um, I'm gonna think about it. It's another surgery. It's more recovery. Um, I'm not too concerned about the shelving appearance. Um, it is a little drastic, but it is what it is. Um, everything's great. The only thing is I'm probably going to need physio just for this one arm. I can put this arm straight up in the air, no problem. Um, uh, but this arm, that's about as far as it can go. And you can even kind of see right here, just how it's pulling and how it's so, so tight. So I have been massaging it and doing my exercises that I was given to go home with, but, um, she thinks that the muscle has kind of attached itself to the scar tissue kind of around the capsule of the implant. So without getting too naked, I'll kind of show you, this is where the implant is. This is where your chest muscle is. My implants are over the muscle, so this shouldn't really be a concern. Um, if you had your implant under the muscle, sometimes it gets constricted and tight, but I shouldn't really be having this problem. Um, so you can just see how it's definitely pulling in this whole area. It is pretty uncomfortable. Um, as I raise my arm, you can see just that tight, tight cording, I guess you could call it cording, um, but it's just so, so tight. Um, so I am gonna start physio because this arm goes up, <laughs> this arm doesn't. Uh, but honestly, if that's the only thing that I'm having complications with, I am totally fine with it. Everything is feeling really good, looking good. Um, I have a little bit of scarring still in these areas where she initially did do the fat grafting. So that's what those little scars are because um, she had injected it this way to kind of help with that slope. But I think a lot of the fat that she put in has dissolved. Um, and then I do have these little scars from where they took the lymph nodes out. Um, I still have some scars right here from where the drains were from the double mastectomy. So that's right there. And then obviously I have my mastectomy scars which go from here to here. So um, for six weeks, I think everything is healing really well. Everything's good. I have a little bit of feeling, um, but some areas I'm still kind of numb and um, don't have the full feeling back yet, which is totally normal. But I just wanted to give a little update because uh, people have been sending me messages and asking how I'm doing and I'm doing great. And um, yeah, I'm gonna think about the fat grafting. I kind of wanna be done having surgery for a little bit since this whole year has just been chemo and surgery, but um, I don't know. Let me know what you think. If, if you would do the surgery, if you wouldn't, I kind of want your opinions because um, this is the issue, is just how it kind of drops, shelving, what they call it. But let me know what you think.